Okay, it is time for us to get back into Grim Tales, the bride. Here's the bride, here's the groom, and we're trying to figure out what happened that fateful night when she apparently jumped off a bridge or was pushed off a bridge. But anyways, let's get into this. We have some finding to do. Let's head over to the prop box and let's do some clicky clicky. So if you haven't seen any of the previous videos, you might want to just either click on the playlist link in the description. Or of course you can always use the annotations to go back and forward and back and forward between all the episodes. Whoa, the hobby horse was huge. This is another episode of a casual game, or a puzzle game, or a hidden object game, whatever you want to call it. And I'm your Gibbs, and guess what? I like these games, and I'm not afraid to say it, to shout it, to record it, and share with everyone. In fact, I have already done about five or six other games by the time that this recording comes out. And of course, after the recording's done, there'll be many more. So yeah, this is part of what the Your Gibbs channel's all about. Ooh, I wonder if I need that. Americas. Alright, so let's start to look at what we have here on the list. We'll do a quick hint here. Oh, okay, so that's the Americas, is it? So we have an orange, a horseshoe, and a screwdriver. Uh, alrighty then. There's the screw. Okay, perfect. So now we need the horseshoe and the screwdriver. Are you guys seeing the items that we're missing here? Wow, that's a horseshoe? That's not what I expected. I expected something almost like the size of a magnet. <laughs> Anyhow, let's keep moving on here. We've got two more things to find. And why are keys not always clickable? Why do I feel like they should always be something we can click? Huh. See that guy there? He's like skiing. Okay, we need to find one more. At least one more. We have an orange and a screwdriver. Hopefully you guys are doing okay. How was your day at work today, or school, or at home, or whatever it is that you did to occupy yourself? How was it? Did you get everything you wanted to get accomplished done today? I want to know about it. And I'm having a hard time with orange. That's not a good thing, is it? I've got this game on full screen, and I cannot find an orange. A slow, slow find. And that orange, how in the hell is that an orange? That's an awful, awful orange. Okay, screwdriver. Beautiful. We need to move on here. Now, where was the screwdriver necessary? I think it was over here, wasn't it? Not there. I don't... No, it wasn't in the fountain. Somewhere had a need for screws. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember it was the swing. The swing. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, this one, yep. There it is, right there. Let's get the lever. Sweet. Alright, we're in business. So we still have the screwdriver. I don't know if it'll work on getting the rope. I think we needed to cut the rope, didn't we? I should cut it. Yeah, okay. Can I shoot it? <laughs> Darn. Okay, well, I have a handle. What else needs a screwdriver or a hook? You know what? Let's go back to the boat. I don't know if we can hook this here. Oh, I need the rope, then the hook, then the boat. Oh. 
crud. Alright, well, let's head back then. Anything else interesting on this page? No? Nothing there. Well, we gotta go back to the basement then. Maybe there's another use for the screwdriver. Uh, what we will do, I think, is put the handle here. There we go. It needs oil. Alright, we need oil. Is there anything down in the basement that can use a screwdriver? Maybe? Please? Nothing that I can see here. Okay, so there's nothing here with Mr. Clown. We did get the gun off of him, and we have to find a reason to use it. So why do we need a gun? We've put the lever there. We still need to get oil. We have a hook and a screwdriver. We still need to figure out what to do here. There's a bottle. Oh, I forgot about this bottle. That bottle of glass could be useful if I knock it down. Can I reach it with the hook? No. Screwdriver? No. Mr. Gun? Oh. <laughs> We're gonna shoot the gun, are we? Alright, the sound didn't match the video, but that's okay. We'll take sharp glass object here. Because I think I know what I need to do next. I'm gonna use the, the stab the bird. Oh, I can't stab the bird. Dang. I wish I could stab the pelican. No? Alright, so let's use it on here. Cutty, cutty, cut, 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 cut. Still seems odd to me, but whatever. Grab the rope. Head back and... Deal with this thingamajiggy. With this thingamajiggy. And I notice I still have the broken bottle, which means I need to use it for something else. Oh, okay. Oh, yes! We have another hidden object to dig through here. What a messy boat. See, this is what I would have thought a horseshoe would have been. But it wasn't. I like this boat. This is a very pretty boat. Ooh, okay, and that's bound to be useful. Don't you think this is a very busy boat with all this junk in it? <laughs> I know these games wouldn't be much games if everything was neat and tidy. But this is a pretty messy boat. You wouldn't be able to sit in here and do any fishing. Don't you think? Or am I uh, delusional here? Alright, uh, what do we have here? What do we need? Let's do a hint. What is that? Oh wow, that's a very uh, chameleon-like lizard. So we have hedgehog, a bottle of wine. Mmm, who doesn't like wine? I like wine. Do you guys like white wine or do you like red wine? Because I'll tell you my answer in a few minutes. I want to know what you guys think. Red wine or white wine? Alright. Or do you like a nice blush? Now that I mention it. Somewhere in between. So we have a flask and an egg. Well, there's Mr. Egg. I'm assuming the flask is like a whiskey flask. And there's Mr. Hedgehog. There's Mr. Flask. Yes, that's right. So I'll give you the answer before I click on the flask is I actually prefer the taste of red, but I do like a white wine in the warm months. So for where I am, that's kind of like the June, July, August. I like the refreshingness of a white wine, but I like the flavor of a red wine. We now have an oil can. Why is that important? <laughs> Crap. Uh, wasn't there somewhere we can put this to get oil? Where was that? Now I'm lost. I don't think you can use it in the water, right? No. Maybe down in the basement. Let's go have another peek. Mechanism. That's that same thing. No, 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 no. 
Well, can the oil just work on it like this? Oh, it can. Hello. I was thinking the oil can was empty. Yes, yes, yes. We're getting the handkerchief. Yes. Grabby, grabby. So, wheat. And there's the... What was he called? The merchant? I've clearly underestimated your skills. The handkerchief contains a message. Through it, maybe use trivially. Oh, though it maybe use trivially. Trivially? Trifly? I don't know what he was trying to say there. Oh, we're back up here. Well, isn't that convenient? Uh. Well, based on the other police tape, we have to cut this stuff. There we go. The gramophone. Someone's taken the gramophone handle. <laughs> He's a screwdriver. Nope. Handkerchief. No. Uh, you know what? Can I go down? I can go down. Because you know what I'm thinking? What if I took the handkerchief and did this? Oh. Okay, well it did something, but... There's some kind of mechanism under the glass. I need to find a way to activate it. There's a niche niche here. I wonder what it holds. Oh. The mechanism won't work without the two fuses. Okay. Alright, so it looks like we have to do some nice uh, fusing there. I kind of like those kind of puzzles, actually. Electrical fuses. I think it brings out the engineer in me. Okay, so... Creepy corridor. Where are we? Paintings above the door. That is kind of creepy. This is my father's room. Why is it locked up so well? Hmm. Good question. Let's go to mother's room then. This is also very <laughs> creepy. Look at the ceiling. That's a problem, isn't it? I do like the... Uh, I'm not sure what you call that, but the wood at the top there. I love that. I mean, other than the spider webs and the kind of other issues here, I kind of like the way this room is decorated. Cupboard. Oh, you know what I've got? Hello. Screwdriver. Uh, what's this? Fuse number one. Cha-ching. I must have to get into this box. Oh my goodness, what are we doing here? A lock piece is missing on the left side. So right here, okay. So let's get out of here. That looks like that might be another mathematical puzzle. Yay. Faith. Hmm. Faith. It's some kind of message. My mother's music box, but where's the ballet dancer that used to dance on top. Ha uh ha. -huh. Are you all following me where I'm going with that? I remember a ballet dancer. She was way, way back here. And if I can actually tune it in right. I think I know what I need to spell. Why don't you guys guess? Have you got it yet? There it is. Faith. Beautiful. Grab the little ballerina. Back upstairs to the mom's music box. And into the mother's room. And over to the mirror. Bam. Aww. I want one of those. Is that wrong? Mm. Okay. What was that? A lock pick. What was locked? Oh, maybe it was the door down here, wasn't it? Oh, no, no, maybe. Let's try Father's room. No? Wasn't there another door locked down here? I like this groovy music. 
There we go. Into the dining room. Hmm. This is not as creepy as I would have expected. Covered. I'm not, I'm missing a handle. Oh. Okay, what about here? I can't open it without a special key. Of course not. Whoa, and I bet you I'm missing a piece. Who wants to bet that right now I am missing a piece? One of the stained glass pieces is missing. Oh, this game is making me laugh. And cry at the same time. What do you guys think? Like, of all of the games that I've recorded, I'm actually liking this one so far the most. Um, I have actually played other adventure games or other puzzle games other than the ones I have recorded, uh, like Dire Groves and 13th Skull and a lot of the Mystery Case File ones. But I think I'm liking this one so far the best of all of them. Call me crazy. Alright, so what are we doing here? Because I am maybe in the room? So we still need a rose for that. Nothing's over there. Okay, so what are we up to now? We have we have one fuse and we have a cupboard that needs a handle. We have a door that needs a piece or whatever. We have a cupboard that needs some sort of special key. So this is obviously needy. We have a niche that needs a fuse. And we have a gramophone that needs a gramophone handle. God, so much neediness here. Uh, was there anything... Oh, what's this? Oh shoot, I missed that the first time. Handle. Okay, well before we go back, we have a father's room that needs a key. We have a mother's room that needs a piece for this thing. We already did the ballerina. Okay, so I guess let's go and deal with the handle. That was in here, wasn't it? I can't believe I missed that the first time around. There we go. <sighs> Yay, we get to do some more finding. Let's get into the cupboard. The messy, messy cupboard. So we let's clicky clicky here. There's our fuse. I know we need two fuses, which is great news. Shiga. Some of that, some onions, a little robot dude in the back. A little doll. What else do we have? A tulip it looks like. A... See that's better. That one that time they actually called it a die, not a dice. Because as you all know, dice is plural for die. Seven times two. What does that even mean? A pot holder. Chili. And a triangle. Where there's a triangle. Seven times two. Are we trying to like... Oh. Yes we are. We're trying to do math. Oh, that's a pot holder. Alright, well let's just do the chili. Okay, it's a chili pepper. We are good to go, and we have our fuse, and we are excited about that, because guess what that means? We can do the niche, or the niche. <laughs> you know what I mean. Dun dun dun, so what do we have here? Set all the fuses horizontally, click the fuse to turn it, then when clicking the fuse changes its position. And Oh my goodness. Oh no, not one of these. I don't like these puzzles. Oh no. I don't 
think I'm happy about this. Oh my god, it did! <laughs> mean to do that honest whoa we're I think we're off to the next part of the game guys and gals a simple lover spat or the precursor to murder it looks as if gray mistreated your sister doesn't it well I guess perhaps the next memory will tell you whether or not he murdered Louisa Huntsman is nothing without his rifle. It's your key to find it. Really? That's going to do it for this chapter. We'll see you next time in the next chapter of Grim Tales The Bride. I'm your Gibbs. Thank you all for watching and commenting and all that good stuff. We'll see you next time.